What's up, Instagram family? So this is what I got for y'all today. I was inspired to do a Lucky 7 Friday reading. Now, the reason why I'm choosing Friday because Friday is a lucky day, okay? And I am promising this firstly to myself that I'm going to be consistent with this every Friday. So expect every Friday a Lucky 7 Friday reading. 7 being me, 7 being a very powerful number. Lucky 7 Friday readings so we can get this healing so we can get this luck so we can get these blessings new doors and getting rid of everything that is stuck okay boom pow all right so um what else i want to uh, say thank you for i just want to say thank you for everybody you know just watching my stories being active and you know liking my posts i really appreciate it i really appreciate the feedback about my wisdoms about um my tarot my oracles that i pull like i really do thank y'all and um it's about time that i shine and you shine okay um i hope you guys found that that money magic helpful um if you've tuned in on YouTube, it's on YouTube. My YouTube is Conscious Wave, okay? And I just might post it on here, on Instagram, for y'all to see in my IGTV. We all need some money blessings, okay? And um, what else? I don't know, but let's go ahead and get this reading, okay? Lucky 7 Friday readings, okay, 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 okay. Ooh, chaos, it's chaotic, but I'm about to give it to you. So I already got one car pulled. And this is for the collective awakening ones, the collective rising, remembering ones, um, that collective, you know, let's see what we can get. Let's see what comes in. Let's see what comes in. Okay. All right. Um, I'm pulling from um, the first card deck I pulled from was the, um, let me get the box. Here we go. The Wisdom of the Hidden Realms by Colette Baron reed I have one of her decks too. Well, I did. Um... The wisdom of the oracle decks. Y'all, if y'all know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. All right? Okay, period. So the next deck, the one I have in my hand here, this is the Healing Mantra deck by Matt Kahn. Mantras are important, so I'm gonna go ahead and um look, grounding my energy. Grounding my energy being the first card. We gotta ground, you know, our mind can get so busy, so heavy. Um and we just have to remember that we are both spirit and in flesh, okay? So, and because we're on this earth, we got to take time for self-care. We have to take we have to take time for quieting our minds, grounding our energy, and connecting to peace, okay? Because I need that. You know, sometimes, especially for us psychics, you know, and higher thinkers, and you know, just a ho space holders for infinite energy we got a ground we got a ground so let's see what mantra wants to come forth for the collective awakened ones on this lucky seven friday okay so the more we rise and heal shift and live the lives that we were designed to the more lucky the more abundant the more prosperous and richer we become and this is what this reading is all about becoming richer having all the doors open that are meant to be open so that we can be fulfilled all the money all the money because we deserve the very best and we all deserve to be privileged okay period and uh that's for my girl um I'm just talking y'all head away. Lord, I forgot. I would, okay, anywho, Jasmine Sullivan. All right, let's get to this reading. Wow, I started channeling y'all, and child, I forgot I was reading. But here we go. Thank you, ancestors, for being in the space. Thank you to my spiritual court for being in the space. There we go. So, what turned over was, my choices determine how bright I shine. Expressing free will. Expressing free will. I don't know if this is backwards for you guys, but expressing free will. Choice. We have a choice. We have a choice on how we choose to shine our light. 
I am one, eternal light appearing as all. So we get to choose our narratives. We get to choose how we want to create. We get to choose what we want to bring in. Expressing free will. And at the bottom of this deck from um, Crystal Angels by Doreen Virtue, we have at the bottom of the deck, Sogalite, the stone Sogalite, own your divine power. Replace codependent people pleasing with assertiveness, with assertiveness and empowerment. Let's own our divine power. Let's just own it. Say you own it. I own my divine power. Let's just sit in it and not have to apologize for it. Ruby, bless your heart. Reach out for emotional and spiritual support to heal and mend your heart. Just let go of the perfection. Let go of the wound, the wounding and the pain. Bless your heart. Bless your heart with the love. Bless your heart with, it was getting real. Bless your heart with forgiveness. Bless your heart with the tears that it needs. Bless your heart with the compassion that it needs. Bless your heart with the forgiveness that it needs. And when you need emotional support, be, don't be afraid, and I just saw an orb, the smoke, don't be afraid to go to somebody that you need to lean your shoulder on. Don't be afraid to say what's on your heart. Don't be afraid to let your